So I will start in English and then we'll uh, change to Hebrew, we'll switch. I will try, I try to make it both to please everyone. So first of all, I never make sh shiurim in Motzei Shabbat. Usually in Motzei Shabbat, I'm going to learn with myself. I have my own seder, but the pressure that Rabbi Yonatan put me on the corner, he wanted so, so much. And I couldn't refuse. He's a, such a sweet guy, such a sweet rabbi, and he's doing so much and put so much effort to bring rabbis to spread out, spread out Torah. And it's amazing and inspired to see his love and passion that we have to the Torah. However, the topic that we will be discussing today is a fascinating one about the situation in Eretz Israel. Amatzav Baaretz u Bechira, as you all know. Uh, we're very concerned about the future, what, what will be in the future in Eretz Israel. Right now, everyone horrified, terrified, scared. They don't know what they should do, if they should uh, stay in the uh, United States, if they move to Eretz Israel. And uh, they told you in Eretz Israel, Vaya Betzion, Anishar Betzion, Kadosh Ya Merlo, Vebear Zion, Ye Peleta, Vebeerushalayim, Tenuchamu. So maybe it's not so safe to stay in the Gola right now, not just in, uh, in America, in all over the world, people are very concerned. And I completely understand it. And I completely not, I, I, I don't agree with all the rabbis, they put they, 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 the people in panic. Right now, you should leave right now, you have a few minutes. Come on, come on. Let's, it's, it's, HaKadosh Baruch Hu Arbe Yotir Achum Bechanun Mizeh. He wants us to, to look on Eretz Israel. He wants us to calculate our moves. And I, I do believe that every, uh, every one of us should look on Eretz Israel, should think, should consider, make plans. But it's nothing panic, nothing for right now, in the moment, right now, just come to Eretz Israel. And I know, Personally, I know a lot of people, they did make Aliyah in a very rush way, and it was a big, huge mistake to them, to the kids, to the family, to everybody. Everything you should consider with a rabbi, you should take advice, and, uh, and HaKadosh Baruch Hu Olam, Baruch Hashem. But right now, everyone is very nervous, not just in Eretz Israel, here in America also. In one hand, we're very happy about the huge chizuk that I see. I'm going from to city to city, מאיר לאיר, מאיירה לאיירה, מכפר לכפר, in Eretz Israel, in the United States as well, and I see people actually become more religious. And people that I couldn't believe even, they put fill in now. It's just because they recently milchama, the war. And also you can see people that I never believed, they, women, they cover their hair and they took on themselves this, uh, it's, and it's not easy for a woman to do such a thing. It's a mamash sacrifice. ואפל פיכם, אתה רואה שיש חיזוק גדול בעם ישראל, unfortunately the circumstances is very bad circumstances, but the bottom line, הרבה מעם ישראל מתחזקים, and people very confused, they don't know what they should do, and how to respond to this uh, בלאגן, how they describe it in the Torah. ותיבה שארץ. Everyone confused, don't know. People actually told me they went to buy a weapon. And, and when they buy a weapon, the store was completely empty. Everyone come to buy a weapon. Even little kids come to buy a weapon. Obviously kids, they're not going to give them, give them a weapon. But uh, you can see, told me the line was one block away. You know, Rehov Shalem Chiku Anashim to buy a weapon. Why, 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 why we so concerned? Why we so nervous? Because you, deep, deep inside, we know that to stay in America, it's just a question of time. In the end, all of us should go back to Eretz Israel, where we belong. Right now, it's a temporary, and everyone here, twenty years, thirty years, they know it's temporary. The heart is there and the body is right here and eventually the body should be there also. The question is what HaKadosh Baruch Hu expect from us, what he doing. So 
I open the Zohar, I open the Mekubalim books, I make my own research, and I will share with you the conclusion that I have, even though some of them not so <laughs> pleasant, but this is the conclusion that I, that I, that I found. First of all, HaKadosh Baruch Hu want to bring the Geula, and the Geula, it's not just, you know, something, Wunderlach Maasios, Mashiach will come, Geula, it's actually life changer. We're supposed to see all the reality change. It's not will be the same what we're familiar until today. Akol olech lishtanot, mashu acher legamre. Now, right now, HaKadosh Baruch Hu want to bring the Mashiach. The Mashiach, Chazal explain it as a baby. ילד יולד לנו, בן בא לנו, ותהי המשרה על שכמו. המשיח זה כמו בייבי. To bring a baby to the world, יש labors, יש צירים. אז ה-labors, I believe you, you know it, all of you, לפחות, שאיץ קם, בהתחלה זה בא לאט, in the beginning it comes slowly. One labor, after a few minutes, another one. When the uh, 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 radion, when the baby should come out, it's become more and more hard and more and more pay, painful. This is how it goes. Zema Sha Kadosh Baruch Hu Ose, this is what the Kadosh Baruch Hu make to bring the Mashiach Laulam. It's is a shakul, the nimshal, le tsirim, vele leida. At sira rishon, the first labor that we got. זה היה בשמחת תורה תשפ"ד. This is only the first. This is only the first labor. And usually the first, it's not so painful like the last labor. So, we in the beginning of a process. The process, it starts already. No one can stop it. Now, there is two kind of leida. שתי אופנים ל... להביא את הבייבי. One kind is a painful, it's hard, it's with... It's a, it's a, it's a very complicated לידה. And the other one, the Gemara said, דף י"ב מסכת סוטה, ותהר ותלד, מכאן לנשים צדקניות שלא היו בפתקה של חווה. Which is mean, sometimes there is לידה בלי תפירות, איך אומרים תפירות? סטיצ'ס. With no stitches, with no pain, very easy. The baby is calm, everybody is happy, and it was very easy for the, the woman and for the baby. So we, in our schuyot, we will decide which, uh, uh, which way we want to take. Right now, it's the moment, it seems like the first one. This is why a lot of people, a lot of soldiers, a lot of um, Israeli citizens, a lot of people lose not just life, they lose the nor normal, normal life. Because גם אלה שנשארו בחיים, החיים שלהם כבר לא יהיו אותו דבר. Even though they, some of the people there, they stay alive, their life completely change. Some of them will be on, the me on, on, on Kadurim on the rest of their life. That's it. Some of them, the, the, what they saw, it's, it's, uh, people came to me with the problems. And I, I cannot even share with you the horror. Ma ya shama bichlal? Ma, what you saw on the YouTube or uh, what you hear on the news, it's nothing compared what really was there. What, how come all the Medina, even the Smolanim, was okay to go after the Arabs? Huh? Because they saw a, 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 a very, very bad condition, very bad situation, what was, what was there. People came to me, people came to me, they said, one of them went to the house, they said, one of them went to the house, and the other one said to you, and tell you something that he saw there. You don't believe as now, we have two choices. Right now, it seems like it's going to, in the first path, <coughs> which is mean, it's going to be a very, very long and very painful uh, pregnancy. And <laughs> 
אם אנחנו רוצים את הגאולה, we want salvation, we want משיח now, we want the בית המקדש, it has to go with the war, it cannot go with the other way, it has to be war. But as I said, there is a war and there is a war. There is a war like a very painful and hurt with sacrifice, and some war, it's easy. Uh, the enemy put his uh, white uh, dagel, Omer, okay, I'm surrounded, that's it, T take me. Right now it seems like it's going to the first way, but why a war? Why war? Why a Kadosh Baruch Hu couldn't just make a shofar gadol lechirutenu? Suddenly you're going out on the street and you hear, tu 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 what's this, what's that? What's this? Okay, the Mashiach came. Everybody go with a car or El Al, I don't know, go to Yerushalayim and chayu be'osher va'osher ad etzem ayom hazem. It's not going to be like that. You understand, right? So why it's supposed to come with a war? Why HaKadosh Baruch Hu bring a war? Milchama atchalat ha-geulai. Ha-milchama hi atchalat shal ha-geula. Which is mean there is no other option. You have to use a war. You need, you need, we wait for this war. This is what Chazal described in Masechet Sanedrin Tzadik Chet. Milchamot Gog Magog. There is three milchamot of Gog Magog. The first one, Yechezkel bring it in Perek Lamed Chet, the second Yechezkel bring it in Perek Lamed Tet, and the third one describe it as Charya in Perek Yud Gimel Yud Dalid. Three of them, it's not the same thing. The first one talk about Gvulot Eretz Yisrael, next to Eretz Yisrael, like Gaza in one end, or Hezbollah in Lebanon in the other end, is Gvulot Eretz Yisrael. The second is described inside of Eretz Yisrael. Zeh Yechezkel, and explain it, sheyeh misvivot Yerushalayim ha-milchama. And the third one, and the, and the most bad war, will be inside of Yerushalayim. This is how I explain it. As you see, there is peimot. The kmo, like I explain you, the labors. Tak, tak, tak. As long as the baby come out, הוא אמור לצאת, אז ממילא יותר ויותר כואב זה יהיה. עכשיו, למה מלחמה? So I saw the Ramak, רבנו משה קורדוברו, he was one of the brilliant מקובלים 500 years ago in צפת, and he explained there is three reasons why we need uh, the Geula will come in uh, מלחמה. The first one, the first one, you have everything that you want in life. You have vacation, you're going to Aruba for Pesach, you're going to, you're going to make shopping in Manhattan, you take a vacation in Hawaii, right? With the flowers, drink nice uh, cocoa water. Yes, you tranquilo, hermano, tienes todo. Usted contento. Everything you have, huh? So for what you need Mashiach? For what you need a Mashiach? You don't need a Mashiach. You in the Geula already. Why? You have a nice house. You have una muchacha, clean everything. Your wife tranquila. Everything is set. You don't need anything. For what? You need Mashiach? You wait for the Mashiach? No. You in the, you in the Geula already. So for what, what, what are you waiting for? So HaKadosh Baruch Hu said, I want them to want the Mashiach. There is a Gemara, Daf Mem Bet Masechet Sukkah. The Gemara says that Zion is Doresh En La. Am Rabbi Yochanan Michlal Debai Derisha. That means if you want the Mashiach, you need to ask for it. There is no such a thing that Kadosh Baruch Hu gives free tickets. You need to ask the ticket. You need to want it. And if you don't want it, he doesn't want to come. This is exactly like we saw in the Zohar two times. Tzadik Gimel Zohar Lech Lecha, Yud Gimel Zohar, Akdamat HaZohar, שעושים ברית מילה, אם אתה לא אומר בפה, if you don't invite אליהו הנביא verbally, זה הכיסא לאליהו הנביא, you come, you welcome, take your chair, he will not be there. He will not come. This is exactly, exactly the Mashiach the same. If you will not invite him to your heart, to your city, to your shul, if you not wait for him, if you, if you don't want him, he will not come. This is only Kedusha like this. Tum'ah, come for free all the time, Tum'ah coming. 
קדושה, you need to invite. בואי כלה, בואי כלה, שבת מלכתה. You need to call the כלה. The Zohar explains, Zohar פרשת תרומה קס"ט, the same thing with the שכינה on the חופה. In, in the חופה, you need to invite. The חתן is, is on חופה, you need to invite the שכינה. I invite the שכינה to come down, and the שכינה come if you don't invite, she's not there. This is exactly the same thing over here. And, and this is exactly what we find in the Zohar, Parashat Emor Tzadik Zayin, on the Ushpizin of the Sukkah and the Sukkot. If you not invite Avraham Avinu, you do Ushpiz Arishon, welcome to my Sukkah. I invite you, I make a chair for you, come please. He will not come. He will not come. And this is exactly like the Mashiach. If you will not invite him, if you will not call him, if you will not ask for it, he will never come. So now HaKadosh Baruch Hu said, look on this guy. In Pesach in Aruba, he doesn't even uh, work so hard to make uh, food for Shabbat. Yeah, he go to Sarat and buy everything already, already make. He want, he, he make an uh, invitation to the hotel. Today they want to, he, he have nice comf comfortable life. He doesn't wait for Mashiach. You waiting for Mashiach? Yes, of course I'm waiting for Mashiach. What do you need? What do you need for him? What? I don't know, Bet Mikdash, Korbanot. Come on, give me a break. You don't really wait for him. Because you don't feel miss anything. When you feel that you miss, I, uh, you know something? I need money. For what? To live. I need food. What? To eat. I need car. For what? To be mobile. To go from here. So when you, you miss something and you get it, you feel catharsis, you feel complete, you feel the satisfaction. Ah. I'm sure everyone here was super hungry one time in his life, at least. At least. Today, people doesn't know how is to feel hungry. Because all the time they feel themselves. All the time. גם העולה ברוך יהיה. אוכלים, אוכלים ולא נודע כי באו אל קרבנה, עוד בעודו וכפו יבלענה. טח, 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 טח. Somebody came to me, אומר לי, he told me, you know, רבי, I so hate. Hanukkah, I hate this holiday. I told him, OMG, OMG, you hate Hanukkah? Why? He said, you know, I'm going to buy for my kids a donut. Sufganiya. So I buy some of them with ribat chalaf, some of them with chocolate, some of them with sprinkles on the top. I buy. I bought, I put it in the, in the car, I bring it home, I put it in the, in the, in the closet for, for the kids when they come back from school. And my wife, when she talking, she didn't even realize that she saw them, it's like magnet. She go there and she eat one after each other. One, two, 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 one after each other. And she came to the house. I told them, so, what's the problem? I bought it for my kids, you know? And she lose it. She lose the shape. No goof, no muta goof anymore. I don't know what to do with this. I told her, I told him, so what? What she asked? She asked diamonds. My big shaya alumim. She asked vacations. Donuts, so give a compliment, give her. He said, I don't care, but parats tayam avaked matzafon avanegba. She going to, she lose, she lose it. So I told them, you know what? You have to love your life, even though she's melea. As he said, melea. I told them, even if she's melea, you have to like her, and it's the oraita. He asked me, where is in the the, the oraita? I told them, katu ba pasuk vaye av Yaakov et Rachel melea. As even though, even though it said melea. אבל לקה מדיבלו מירזה באורייתא, דף ט עמוד א' במסכת תענית. However, however, if you do, if you, one time in your entire life you were super hungry. Back then, few years ago, people was miserable. The food, it wasn't so, uh, like, like today so much. People was very hungry. People went to sleep hungry. And they cherish and they appreciate the food. Now today you have food in your, in your fridge. You open the fridge. It's all full. Nothing to eat in this house. Come on. Come on. 
back then, back then people actually, actually they cherish the food, the food they are something. But let's say one time you were starving. You came home and you saw your wife make dinner, Baruch Hashem, Baruch Hashem Yemot HaMashiach, and then you ate. After you finished to eat and it was a good meal, how you feel? <sighs> you feel satisfaction. This is how Kadosh Baruch Hu wants us to feel when the Mashiach will come. <sighs> but you don't, you don't feel even miss anything. You're going to Aruba, you're going to vacation, you're going to Hawaii, you're going to Manhattan, you're having a nice life, you buy whatever you want. So which satisfaction you will feel if you don't feel miss? When you was hungry and you will get the food, then you feel good with yourself because I complete. Omrim be'ivrit, sagarti lo tapina. Nizgar lo apina. Lama? He complete his miss. O ya chaser achshav umale. אבל when you don't you don't feel any you don't feel even that you miss to Hakadosh Baruch Hu you don't know that there is such a feeling to miss Hakadosh Baruch Hu you see how miserable your situation that you don't even realize that you're in a bad situation this is the worst case ever Meile bishlama somebody is sick and he said you know what I know I'm sick or somebody over eat crazy. And he keep eating. Oh, no, 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 like who? However, when you feel, when you have this feeling that something missing in your life, you know what's the most popular pills they sell in the stores? Anti-depression. Why? Why you should be depress depressed? There is no war in your country. Everything is good. This is the problem. There's everything is good. This is the problem. So something missing. If you have a nice steak and you eat a nice steak in the restaurant and you love your Tesla and you want your Tesla to eat also steak, but Tesla doesn't eat steaks. So let's take some other car. I don't know, Ferrari. And Ferrari, you need to give her a gas to put a gas to, um, to uh, make her drive, right? And you like the steak and you take the steak, you open the gas place and you put steak inside. It will not work. You ruin all the system. It will never work. This is like a Kadosh Baruch who gave us Ruchaniut ve Gashmiut. When you try to feed your Ruchaniut with Gashmiut, it will never work. And you will be miserable. And you don't even realize why you're miserable. So you will try to run away from yourself. You go into this vacation from that, you buy for yourself a new cell phone, a new car, a new, and you're still miserable because you try to feed your soul with steaks. It will never work. So how I make myself happy? Only if you will miss HaKadosh Baruch Hu, if you will, you will try to reach another level on Avodat Hashem. People doesn't wait to Mashiach because they don't know what's this Mashiach about. הם אפילו לא מבינים מה זה משיח, אתה יודע מה אני צריך למשיח? אני לא יודע מה זה משיח, מה זה משיח? שאני אבוא לירושלים ונבנה בית המקדש? מה? מה? What will be different? When the משיח will came, and you will be in ירושלים, you will cry. But you will not cry for now, you will cry רטרואקטיבית על כל מה שהיה בעבר שלך. I didn't realize that even my life was hell. Right now I realize. So when HaKadosh Baruch Hu want, to, want us to ask for the Mashiach, he needs to choke us. This is how it is. When life is in normal circumstances, when you're happy, I don't need the Mashiach. So what, what, so what HaKadosh Baruch Hu expect from us to do? To ask for him. Bo Kala, Bo Mashiach, we want you, you invite, this is your chair, please come. But no one ask for Mashiach. When we ask, we ask in the Mashiach? No, we could. Uh, uh, our life, it's amazing. 
So what the Kadosh Baruch Hu do? Bring a war. When he bring a war, the war, it's a darkness. It's a bad situation and sick people and people die and you're worried and you're in panics and you don't know what will be and you're concerned and you... So then, Baruch Hashem, you start to wake up. You, we, need, we need salvation. But if Tzva Gana Israel will win, Lo Tzach Tamashiach. Lama? We're strong. We have huge army. We have Anshe Mossad, Modi'in. Yesh lano et Rosh HaMemshalai, Kealav. Roim keilu yesh lano, we trust on people. Why? We don't need the Mashiach. For what we need, HaKadosh Baruch Hu? We will, we handle. Everything is good. One time was guy, look for a parking. You know, in New York, it's almost impossible to find a parking. You look on parking, you go, he went, he went, in other street, in other street, you couldn't find a parking. So we look up, he said, Ribbon Olamim, I promise you, if you will give me place to park, I promise you, I'm going to shul. Suddenly, he, he take his head down, he sees some, someone just leave the, the, the park. He said, wow, thank you. I don't need you anymore. I, I'm okay. He didn't realize that HaKadosh Baruch Hu did it. Sometimes when you trust too much on people, so HaKadosh Baruch Hu Omer, so I, you trust him, go with him. That's it. This is how it goes. Sadiq Alif Amut Bet Baba Batra. Agmara Omeret Man Derachitz Laun Diledi Leon. Mishabotech Bebnei Adam HaKadosh Baruch Hu Samoto Bayadayim Shel Bnei Adam. For what we need Mashiach? We need Mashiach to come to make milchama. We need HaKadosh Baruch Hu ויצא ביום ההוא ונלחם כביום מלחמו כיום קרב. We don't need you. צהל עשה את העבודה. We don't need you. So what HaKadosh Baruch Hu did? Make everyone blind. Everyone. ראש הממשלה לא ידע מהפדיחה הזאת, והראש המוסד לא ידע, וראש המודיעין לא ידע, והצהל לא ידע, והמשטרה לא ידע. No one, no, no one, even one person, you know how much money they put on this of, of save and military in Israel? A lot of millions of, of, of shekels. Where, where is everybody? So what Kadosh Baruch Hu Asa? Sagar l'kulam ta'enayim. For what? Tem botchim ba'em? Be'ele atem botchim? Look in yourself. A very, very small country like Gaza. Very small country. All the universe. Stand up. Kulam pitom yala imal daber al Israel. Vafilu Israel, kulam be Israel horrified, terrified. You're talking about only 2,000 mechablim. Bau im kafkafim be Toyota. Zesh ma shem bau. Kafkafim be Toyota. Do you know what Toyota? Im kafkafim shelaem. Zesh ma shem. Al ze, kol ha medina kama, kol ha olam kam, kul ha mefakdim, lo yodim. Ma yye kshe Iran tachlit lishloach til? Ha? מה יהיה כש, כשפוטין יחליט לעשות יד אחת עם סין, יד אחת עם ארדואר של טורקיה, יד אחת עם, המ, עם המחבלים שבתוך מדינת ישראל? אין מדינה. על אלפיים מחבלים בקושי הצלחתם. אז מה אתם רוצים עכשיו? בטח שלא יהיה מדינה. אז למה הקדוש ברוך הוא עושה את זה? Try to realize this is the first labor. When the second will come, I hope you understand these people will not save you. You have to make your ishtadlut. Tzava chayav la'asot Moshe Rabbeinu gam asa tzava beparashat matot, elef lamate, elef lamate. Ishtadlut we have to do. Aval don't trust them. Like they never save these people in Otef Aza, in Simcha Torah, they will not save you. In Tel Aviv, in Yavne, in Ashdod, in Yerushalayim. They will not save you. Everyone will be busy to save themselves and their family. Who will save you? Rak HaKadosh Baruch Hu. And then, when he put you in a corner, when he shock you, then you need Mashiach. So then you will ask the Mashiach from the bother of your heart, Ribbon HaOlamim, Igiu Maim Ad Nafesh, please save us. Please send us the salvation. Send us the... תשלח לנו את המשיח. And then you, you call him? זה הכיסא של אליהו הנביא, בוא, 
בואי היא כלה, בואי היא כלה, you invite them, then המשיח will come. So you will realize right now that what we see right now, it's a part, it's the beginning of the huge complicated plan that הקדוש ברוך הוא plan to show himself in the world. זה למה הקדוש ברוך הוא עושה. מה הוא עושה? מביא לנו את הציר הראשון, כדי שנבקש את המשיח, זה ההתחלה. And the second thing, it's the... כי אם יצאת לך מארץ מצרים, הרינו נפלאות. הגמרא אומרת שבמצרים, כמה מכות היה במצרים? עשר מכות, נכון? עשר מכות. לעתיד לבוא פי חמישים. הראינו נפלאות נון פלאות. חמישים מכות. במצרים עשר מכות, דם צפרדע כינים ערוב דבר שכין וכולי עד מכת בכורות. עשר מכות. And it was stunning. It was amazing. It was more than Hollywood show. היה amazing. לעתיד לבוא בגוג ומגוג יהיה פי חמישים. And I ask you, I'm asking you, for what you need to make פי חמישים If, if you live normal circumstances, right now, you need 50 פלאות? מה, פתאום אתה תלך תראה צפרדעים ברחובות פה, פתאום אתה תראה את הערוב פה, הולכים ערוב, אתה תראה, המים נהפך לדם, למה אני צריך את זה? For what we need it. אבל when הקדוש ברוך הוא put you in the worst situation, and you need salvation from the strong enemy, and you realize that you weak, You realize that you cannot beat him up. He was much more stronger than you. It's the all umot ta'olam neged am Yisrael. You cannot survive this one. But then, HaKadosh Baruch Hu will come, and he bring the 50 makot al umot ta'olam, and he show himself. So right now, the Sfarim said, the Aramah Kotev, חמישים פלאות לעתיד לבוא. עכשיו אנחנו לא צריכים את החמישים פלאות. אז צריך לשים אותך in situation that you need this חמישים פלאות. So you understand right now why we need war? First of all, we need war because only through the war we can ask משיח now, but really to ask from the bother of the, our, our art. And the second thing, it's because הקדוש ברוך הוא want to show himself. To show is, is the master, is the Baal Abayit of this world. How we show it? How we show it? With miracles. Okay, we don't need miracles. Now you don't need. But if I will put you in a situation of war, a situation that you need me, then you will need a, 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 a miracles. So this is why HaKadosh Baruch Hu bring the, the, the Geula, Milchama, Atchalat HaGeula. Lama Tzarech Milchama? כי אנחנו, הקדוש ברוך הוא want to show himself in the world. In other thing, הקדוש ברוך הוא want ל, 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 לסגור את החשבון עם כל אומות העולם על כל מה שעשו לנו כל הגלות. אנדריאנוס, וטיטוס, ואנטיוכוס, ובלשצר, ונבוזרדן, ואספסיאנוס, וכל אלה הרשעים, הקדוש ברוך הוא want to... to... kick them up. זה מה שהקדוש ברוך הוא רוצה לעשות. איך הוא יעשה את זה? יבא הבאתי את כל הגויים אל ירושלים למלחמה הזו, כותב בפרשת נוח, דף נ"ח עמוד ב', שיגלגל אותם הקדוש ברוך הוא את כל הרשעים במנהיגים של אומות העולם. מי יודע אם פוטין הזה זה לא גלגול של נבוכדנצר, ומלך ומל, איראן זה לא גלגול של בלשצר, וההוא הוא לא גלגול של ההוא, עד שכולם יהיו אגנסט אס. הרי... כשרוסיה התחילה, התחילה את המלחמה עם אוקראינה, אז עמד שר החוץ, נראה לי הוא היה שר החוץ אז, יאיר לפיד, ודיבר אגנסט רוסיה. And I never understand what you're doing. What you're doing? What you put us in this corner? For what? For what? What you care? דיבר אגנסט רוסיה. Since then, רוסיה באופן מגמתי against Israel. Because one stupid guy. Now, when Biden took the, the president, to be a president, Trump wanted to show that it was all fake, something was wrong. So instead, Bibi Netanyahu will wait a little bit. You see something's going on. Wait, he was the first one to call to say Mazal Tov to uh, President Biden. Since then, Trump against Israel. 
and he was the most popular uh, um, friend with Israel. So now you understand, אם הקדוש ברוך הוא לא איתך, אתה לא תצליח בכלום. אם השם לא עם המנהיגים, כי המנהיגים לא עם השם. אז אתה, אתה תחליט שאתה רוצה לעשות טוב, יצא מזה רע. תעשה עוד מהלך? Apparently it was tragedy. ככה הקדוש ברוך הוא עושה. למה? כי המנהיגים לא איתו. ולמה הוא לוקח להם את השכל? One, כי הם בכלל לא דתיים והם לא רוצים את הקדוש ברוך הוא. ושתיים, כי הקדוש ברוך הוא בכוונה מכוון אותם ללכת לדיזסטר, ללכת ל-wrong ל- way, כדי להביא אותנו לקורנר, כדי שאנחנו נצטרך את המלחמה. אז אתה מבין שכל מה שקורה עכשיו, זה יש מי שמכוון את הכל מלמעלה ומסדר את הכל כדי, לה, כדי להביא אותנו לגאולה. זה לא רנדמלי, לא היה כאן בעיה אקסידנט, הם לא היו שם. לא יודע, היה פדיחה של המדינה, איזה פדיחה, חכי בלב שזה פדיחה. יכול להיות שאף אחד לא היה שם, לא הצבא, לא המשטרה, כוחות המודיעין, כוחות הביטחון, אף אחד לא ידע מזה ש- שנה שלמה הם מתאמנים שם על הגדר, איזה פדיחה. אם לא הוא, הקדוש ברוך הוא סוגר לכולם את העיניים כדי להביא אותנו למלחמה, ואתם חושבים שזה ייגמר שם? This is the first labor. חכו לפעימה השנייה מחיזבאללה, חכו לפעימה השלישית מאיראן, חכו לפעימה הרביעית שכל אומות העולם יהיו אגנסט עם ישראל. גוג ומגוג עם תרי השבעים. שבעים, שבעים אומות העולם נגד עם ישראל. יכול להיות שנשרוד? בפשט לא. אי אפשר לשרוד. <laughs> בקושי עכשיו הם יכולים לשרוד. אם לא אמריקה שולחת את הצי של הספינות שלה להרתיע את חיזבאללה, כבר מזמן היו מוחקים חיזבאללה את ישראל. אז מה? אז יכול להיות שנשרוד? We can survive? We cannot! But the Midrash said, שבעים זאבים מול כבשה אחת, בחיים אין לה סיכוי. אבל אם לכבשה הזאת יש רועה, שאם somebody guide her, protect her, save her from the wolf, אם השם רועי לא יחסר. אתה רואה שאחר כך, לאט לאט, כל האומות יתחילו להיות שתי, שתי מחנות. מחנה אחד with Israel, מחנה אחד against Israel. כאילו שישראל עכשיו זה ההיילייט של העולם. אבל ככה זה קורה. אתה רואה שכולם פתאום מכווים דעתם. אוקראינה קוטשת, קוטשת רוסיה את אוקראינה. אף אחד לא דיבר. מישהו צייץ? מישהו אמר איזה מילה? אף אחד לא דיבר. פה אנחנו רק פרוטקט אס. צבא הגנה, זה לא התקפה. זה הגנה לישראל. וכולם פותחים את הפה שלהם. We need a support from סלב מ-LA, we need support from this, we need support... על מה אתה מדבר? בחיים אתה לא תצליח. יש שתי מחנות. לאט לאט, גם המחנה שיהיה with עם ישראל will turn around and will become against עם ישראל. This is what's going to happen. I tell you right now. It's going to be against עם ישראל. אז כל העולם כולו יהיה... שתי מחנות, with or without עם ישראל, and suddenly, slowly, slowly, even, even this מחנה שעם עם ישראל, go with them and everyone will be against עם ישראל. And then you realize you need נון פלאות. You, you need משיח נאו. You need הקדוש ברוך הוא ל-help you. Because in circumstances as is right now, you don't need משיח. You have everything. So now you realize that כל מה שקורה זה הקדוש ברוך הוא עושה מלמעלה כדי, לה, כדי לנווט ולסדר, to guide us, to show us the way to the גאולה. So we need to get panic? If I give you this news, of course you need to get panic. What do you think? That I came to tranquilo? Huh? I came to put you in panic. Stop. No, I'm joking. דגמרא עושה צדיק חטא מוט בית מסכת סנהדרין. מה יעשה אדם וינצל מלחמת גוג ומגוג? שאלו תלמידיו את רבי אליעזר הגדול. מה יעשה אדם וינצל מלחמת גוג ומגוג? אמר להם, יעסוק בתורה וגמילות חסדים. I give you the recipe, if you want to save yourself, if you want to save your wife, if you want to save your kids, if you want to save your properties, whatever it is, you need salvation, you need protection. I will show you what you should do. This is the recipe. Sanhedrin Tzadik Chet Beit. מה יעשה אדם וינצל ממלחמת גוג ומגוג? He told them, יעסוק בתורה וגמילות חסדים. 
Now, I always said there is Torah and there is Torah. There is Torah, somebody sit and learn, and he doesn't like to sit and learn. And he learned like this. He just wait, the shiur will finish. He just wait, the Rabbi Hananiah ben Akasha will come and save him. <laughs> he doesn't like the shiur. He doesn't like the rabbi. He doesn't like anything. But you said, Lasok ba Torah, I'm scared. So when you say ba Torah, it's also something. But you need some other Torah. You need something else. יקרבו, הנה פרשה של השבוע, פרשת תולדות. יקרבו ימי אבל אבי והרגה את יעקב אחי. This is what עשיו said בליבו. יקרבו ימי אבל אבי והרגה את, אה, אה, את יעקב אחי. You hear him? Come now. Come now. Kill him now. For what you need to wait? Some of them said he really loved his father, so he doesn't want him to be sad that his son killed by other son. We saw it with Adam Arishon with Cain and Evel. Some of them said, now he didn't care about his father uh, Itzhak. Why he did it? Why he wait? Why he said he krevu yame evel avi? Right now, Yankel learning. Yaakov ishtam lomed Torah, yoshev oalim. Oel Torah shebikhtab, oel Torah shebaal pe. He learning. And he is a very matmid, Yaakov avinu. When a call call Yaakov, azena yadaim yedei sav, he cannot do anything, he cannot hurt him, nothing. He protect, because the Torah guna magna, that's all he matzla. The Torah save him. But when Abba will die, then Yaakov Avinu consider Avel. Avel asur be divrei Torah. If he has no divrei Torah, now in a call call Yaakov, then I can, then I can reach him. Azena yadaim yedei sav. When a call call Yaakov, lo lomdim Torah, or you don't let to other people to learn Torah, like we see it in Israel, as yavoh ayadaim shel Hamas, yavoh azroa asmalit shel Islam, yavoh yavoh viochlu utcha. Aval ani shoel, avel asur bedivrei Torah, aval mutar lo lilmod elchot avelut. As Yaakov avinu bezman avelut ilmod elchot avelut. לא יעלה על הדעת שיעקב יושב כל היום ככה על הרצפה ויקבל אבלים. הוא רוצה ללמוד. Without Torah, you can, I, if, uh, I tell you on myself, I can't function. I, I'm not myself. I become moody. I become stressed. I can't think clearly. This is my drugs. One time I was a rabbi here in, uh, in uh, Hollywood, and one time One of the guy after the lecture tell to ask me, Rabbi, which drugs you taking? Tell them, come on, you're killing me, right? He said, no, no, you're on drugs. I can tell you, you're on drugs. I told him, I'm not, I'm not taking anything. What do you want from me? He said, I don't know. The fast you're talking, the fast you're thinking, you're on trip. I know you take something. <laughs> I didn't realize which drugs you take. I told him there is a Gemara in Zayin Amudalf Masechet Taanit. Zot Atura Asher Sam Moshe Zachan Eset Lo Sam Chaim Lo Zachan Eset Lo Sam Amavet. The Torah, there is Torah when it's quality Torah, give you focus, show you the direction that you should go. בתלחיכה תנחה אותך, בשוכבך תשמור עליך, ובקיצות היית שיחך, כ"א עמוד ב' מסכת סוטה. And there is Torah that you're learning, you're more exhausting and you're more tired. I never really understand. Let's just say this is what I saw think. He said, Ah, when Abba will die, Yaakov cannot learn Torah, and then I can beat him up. Oh, yeah? But Yaakov is going to learn. What are you going to learn? Ilchot Avelut. If he's still learning, אין הידיים ידי עשיו. אז מה הועילו חכמים בתקנתם? אלא מה? יעקב will learn when יצחק will die. But it will be said. It will be said, אבא מת. He learned Torah, but it will be with grave. It will be with sadness. It will be with, with, with no... With no חשק לתורה, because אבא מת. אחרי הכל, bottom line, אבא מת. תורה עם עצבות, תורה שלא משמחת, it's not protect you. There is תורה and there is תורה. The תורה, the quality תורה, when you learn in, when enjoyment, when excitement, this is תורה can protect you. One time I was in New York and I saw a rabbi give a lecture there, I don't even know his name. 
His lecture was a fascinating. He was so happy. You can see he loved the Torah. You can see he eat Torah, he, he sleep Torah, he wake up Torah. This is guy of the Torah. You can see, you can't fake it. You can't fake it. You can feel who is love Torah and who is just mumbling for you. Titchasku, titchasku, v'acharez ata roi oto bakazino. It's very easy. Very easy. No. So I came to the rabbi. I told him, Rabbi, I'm so impressed. In this. It's the first time in my entire life that I see such a enthusiasm, such enjoyment, such an excitement. I, I'm jealous. So he told me, Rabbi Meir, I'll be honest with you. Otherwise, I don't have a reason to live. That's it. If you reach this level that otherwise I don't have a reason to live, this is Torah שהקדוש ברוך הוא מנשק אותה. זה תורה אמיתית. שעד שהוא כותב הרמב״ם, הלכות רוצח פרק ז' הלכה א', הוא מביא את הגמרא מסכת מכות דף י'. הוא כותב שמה, חיי בעלי החוכמה ומבקשיה בלא תלמוד כמיתה חשובים. רוצח שרצח בשגגה גולה לעיר מקלט. אם הוא רצח בשגגה, הוא גולה לעיר מקלט. הוא מגלים רע בו אמו, גם הרב גולה לעיר מקלט. אבל הרב לא רצח! מי רצח בשגגה? התלמיד, שהתלמיד ילך לעיר מקלט. What do you, what, are, what is Rabbi fault? What do you want from him? מה אני עשיתי? מה אני עשיתי? He didn't make anything. The rabbi said, רבם wrote, זה גמרא במחצכת מכות. למה? כי כתוב, ונעשה לך דערים האל וחי. You will make sure he will live. You give him all the conditions that he need to live, to make a nice, comfortable uh, uh, environment of life. ואם איז רבי נוט ווידם, אי רדר טו די. חיי בעלי החוכמה ומבקשיה בלא תלמוד כמיתה חשובים. This is what this rabbi told me, otherwise I don't have a reason to live. If you reach this level, זה, זה level הכי גבוה. We cannot reach there, but at least understand There is Torah with Simcha, and this is what the Zohar said, Zohar Vait Hanan. He said, if you want to remember the Torah, I'll give you a nice tip. If you love the Torah, you will remember it. If you don't love the Torah, no matter what you will do, how much you learn, how much Chazarot, it will not get inside of you. If you love something very, very, and you want it very strongly, you will get there. You will get there. You will remember everything. But if you will just learning, you know, just when I got the para, when I'm so bara betzida, when I'm mumbling, what I'm mumbling, as the loyelech, the loyelech. As now, Torah and Gemilut Chasadim, this is why what will save you. This is the recipe will save you from the chemed gog and magog. Gemilut Chasadim, k'mo la aniach tefillin la'acherim, k'mo liftoach shul, k'mo la argen shurei Torah, k'mo la asod gmachim. Kol ma sheyeh Gemilut Chasadim ve Torah. אבל תורה, לא תורה מיזרבל תורה, תורה with excitement, תורה with joy, תורה with happy, תורה that you, ex- you wait for the next class, you wait for it, you love it. If you don't enjoy from this rabbi, go try other rabbi. You don't like this, uh, this topic, go try other topic. It's just like restaurants. You go into this restaurant, they told you we have uh, tempura. You want tempura roll? Yeah, I want tempura. No time. You're going to other restaurant. Tell me, you have tempura roll? Yeah. Oh, this is nice. This is how they make tempura. Why? But it's the same dish. It's not the same chef. It's not the same Chinese. Everyone make different, the food different. This is with Torah, is, is this just the same. If you like some rabbi and his, his Torah get inside of you, change you, make a difference in your life, this is your rabbi. If no, it's too much for me. I don't like him. It's too, it's too scary. It's too, okay, there is other rabbis. The Gemara said, Daf Nun Chet Amut Bet Masechet Brachot Partufeim Shonim Deotem Shonim. As Kol Echad HaRabbi Shamatim Lo. With a dish, it's uh, for him. אחד אוהב בשר, אחד אוהב דגים, אחד אוהב תלמוד, אחד אוהב זוהר. כל אחד מה שהוא אוהב. אז בעזרת השם, I think this is the best conclusion of this show. Really, we don't need to get panicked. But, but, we need to fill up this recipe, תורה וגמילות חסדים. 
I highly recommend to each and every one of you will look on Eretz Israel. You don't know what's going to be here. America, it's temporary. It's not for permanent. Kola Galut is temporary. So now, everyone think about to buy a house in Eretz Israel, even to close it, or to buy a house and to rent it. But you know, they, they will come and you will run away from Egypt. You have some, some place, some corner, some spot that you can lie on in Eretz Israel. It's a good. And it's also good, I think, to have a, to have a, a gun. To have a gun. I told in Musayov to Moshe in Musayov, you need, you need a tank. Tank you need. And it's not a surprise if I see a tank in the house of the Bukhah. It's not a surprise. אבל כל אחד, <laughs> וכמובן, אל תראי תולעת יעקב, our power it's, it's in our lips, it's, it's our tongue, אל תראי תולעת יעקב, use it, use it well. תורה, גמילות חסדים, it's the השתדלות בשמיים ממעל, וצריך השתדלות על הארץ מתחת. Maybe to buy something, maybe to, to, uh, to say, to protect yourself and your family. Don't trust it, but you have to do השתדלות. אז הנה יש לך השתדלות גם מכאן, והשתדלות גם מכאן, ואין ספק, I, I have no doubt שהקדוש ברוך הוא want to save us, and want to deliver us, and want to bring the גאולה already, and we wait for it, but we need to ask for it. אז יהי רצון שהקדוש ברוך הוא ישלח לנו את משיח צדקנו, שנזכה לראות במהרה בימינו בבניין בית מקדשנו, במהרה בימינו אמן. אמן.